So if you're using Discord and can't see uh, your icons appear in the UI, as you can see, I can see mine just fine. But in case yours are missing, there are a few things that you can try and do to make sure that Discord is running as it should. And the first one is to completely close Discord and restart it. Now, the easiest way of doing this is to simply right click your start menu option and then head over to task manager. Once task manager opens up, we're going to find Discord in here and then just click the end task button to close Discord. Now, just to check, I'm going to search the task manager just to see if there are any other processes or dis Discord background processes running in the windows. Since there are not, so I can just close task manager, open up the uh, start menu, search for Discord again and restart it. And this should launch Discord without any problems on your system. So as you can see, it's opened up and I can see all of my icons without any problems. If this doesn't work, you can try renaming the ETC folder in your Windows System32 drive. Now to do this, press Windows key plus R to open up the run prompt. And now we're going to type in a specific path here. So C colon backslash Windows System32. And then we're going to type in drivers and then ETC. Go ahead and press enter. Now you will see a bunch of different files here. So we're going to go ahead up a level and you will see this ETC folder. What we're going to do is rename this ETC folder to basically anything you want. The only point is we're preserving this folder in case you need to come back to it. But once we rename it, Discord will not be able to access it and it will create a new set of files that it's going to use and hence that should fix our problem that doesn't work either your best bet is to check discord for any updates that might have appeared now doing so is rather easy discord automatically checks for updates every time you start it but in case you need to manually get one head over to user settings and then in here we should have an option for updates so we're just going to go ahead and search it yeah, notifications uh, so you get announcement and review updates all right so it may not be showing up in uh, the discord settings here but what you can do is that you can just head over to the discord website and download the latest version of discord from there so in this case it's going to be just going to quick a quick google search for discord that will take us to discord.com and now you can uh, download Discord for Windows here, which will be the latest version and install it again, which will override your existing installation. Or you can simply open up Discord in your browser. And last but not least, if nothing else works, your best option is to go ahead and reinstall Discord from scratch. Now to do this, press uh, right click the Windows icon, start menu icon, and then click on install apps. This will open up the Windows installed app section. And now we're going to search for Discord in here. Once you find Discord, go all the way to the right, click on these three dots and then click uninstall. Windows will ask you if you really want to uninstall Discord, we know what we're doing. So go ahead and click on uninstall again. Then you can head back to the Discord website and re-download it for Windows and hopefully fix your problem. If you like this video, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such videos can we make for you. If you'd like to know more about tech, visit our website, Candido Technology, follow us on social media. And if these videos don't help you out as much, do consider getting a membership. That's it for today and we'll see you in the next video.